Pepper Creek Outdoors. We've had a great weekend. We all love each other. Creek Outdoors. Uh, we're here with me, Steez, and Tyler. We're about to go hang some lines, see if we can catch some alligators. We got our chicken here. Anyway, we're gonna put the chicken online. We're about to go catch some gators. Uh, hopefully get some Tyler a new wallet, I think is what he wants. Yes. So, uh, we'll see what we get out there and uh, y'all uh, come for the ride. I'm sure it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> hey, Travis, get a picture of all, show us all your fingers. We'll do a before and after. We got 10 all digits, full digits right now. It's all this negative energy is the reason we're not going to catch any. It's because you're such a jerk. No, we're just going to let you be the bait. That would have been my idea all along with you. So, earlier this week, a possum died in my front yard. <laughs> I don't know what happened to it. We thought about bringing it, but it had been cooking in the trash can all week. And, uh, Correction. Couldn't we did stand not think about bringing it. You thought about bringing it. Couldn't stand the smell. It was terrible. <laughs> you thought about bringing it. Been cooking in a trash can probably at 120, 125 for four days straight. <laughs> moral of the story, roadkill stinks when you leave it sitting out. Yeah, that's a moral of the story. <laughs> All right. Chicken. That's true. All right, hand me the clip. Blue? Which one's in? I don't care. Blue? Now Tyler, he's been studying on how to tie these knots for the past week, all right? We're gonna see how well he does. We're um, headed to Bird Island. We're following all these birds here. We're not going to Bird Island. <laughs> uh, so don't go look for no alligators there. Get all those chickens. I asked a buddy why it was called Bird Island earlier. Now I feel like an idiot. But we're not at Bird Island. But we're not at Bird Island. Like I said. Hey, 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 whoa, whoa. You gotta turn it on. <laughs> we ain't making it. You gotta get the key and turn it on to start. Keyway. Yeah, I see. I see. I was thinking the same thing. thing, but I was like, mm. "We don't need any of these other parts." <laughs> I don't know. Mm -hmm. This looks like a pretty. This has got to be it. say we we fixed Jacob's boat but I really didn't do anything thank God Jordan showed up he's the one who fixed it 
Uh, Trey and Jacob are going to be in Jacob's boat. Us three will be in ours. Um, kind of nervous about my knots and my knot tying abilities. Uh, also kind of nervous for Trey's life and Jacob's life. Get that out there. Uh, any comments, Steve? Uh, hoping we got a gator on there. Uh, hope Jacob and Trey make it out there, make it back alive. Um, but I mean, worst case scenario, they sink and then they tell us where the gators are. That's true. So, so that's a whole different thing. <laughs> we didn't plan it like that, but we are ready for that. Yes. You gotta be prepare. ready. Yeah, yeah prepare, prepare for the worst. Yep. Yep. Practice like you play. Yep. And Jacob always screws up, so we're gonna be ready for him to screw it up. Kidding. Uh, but we will be there to rescue them. Will they bring life jackets? Probably not. Probably not. So probably not. So stay tuned. Welcome to Keppel Creek Outdoors, where we. Hey, let's get the motor running. Look you there, boy. Steve's got the magic touch. After we ran it yesterday. Steve got the magic touch. Atta boy, Steve. It's day two of alligator hunting. We uh, put the lines out yesterday. We're getting this heavy fog from the motor. Uh, hopefully you can see through it. Uh, it's real good for the oxygen for your lungs, you know? So we're going to check out these lines. We hope we got something. Put the chicken out yesterday. We didn't put any seam seasoning on it. Shout out. Uh, it's probably not gonna, probably gonna catch the small gators because of that. But if we catch anything at all, I'll be happy. We got Jacob up there in the other boat. He's got his gator tail. He uh, don't, scared to put it in the water though, because uh, he don't want to hit a stump. Because I guarantee you, the first stump he hits, the whole prop's gonna fall off, and he left the other props at the house. So uh, we're gonna have to tow him back. But that's why we brought this uh, rope. this rope to tow him back, not to tie the gators up or anything. But so you look at him. If you look at him, uh, he has no idea what he's doing. <laughs> He's gonna chop us up because he's not gonna put it down in the water. Look at it, look how he turns. He won't just turn it in the water, he just picks it up and moves it over. That's how you know it's a good good boat. That thing's gotta have 50,000 miles in the air. Are we ready? Calibrate. All right. We got a puff boat, you got plenty of time. You got time. And uh, we'll be back with you here in a little bit. Over and out. If he just grabbed the edge, well, it still would have pulled it out of the thing. Is the chicken down there? No. Look around for him. I mean, there's no way. Think these clips are too dang heavy? Well, I think it would have broke that limb. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm thinking. Here you go. Nothing. Nothing. He took the chicken. How do you take the chicken and not the thing? All right. Well, he'll be back. Yeah, we'll try again. That's wild. Get closer. Hey, there's one in the water right here. Does that not look like a gator? Yeah. One hundred percent small. His freaking eye is sick. That's his eye right there. Shoot his freaking face off, see? You got you recording? Yeah. Shoot his face off, see? There you go. <laughs> I mean, it's like this big. Yeah. I thought 
thought I hit him that second time. Yeah. Let's go. One. I'm as uh, <laughs> we about to limit out today. As as oh, hard hey. as hard as it was to kill that one, I'm scared of what like a six footer would be like. Right Tyler here. It's been a great weekend. Day one, put out some gator lines. Uh, found a few spots. The whole lake looks like just the best gator hunting of all time. Uh, so put out a few lines, baited them up, went back the next morning. That's when Steve uh, killed that gator. A uh, small one, but uh, we were on the board. We filled one tag, only got two left. Fired up about it, came back, Trey cooked. It was awesome. Family came in, uh, some of our wives, some of our kids. It was just a great time. That's what it's all about anyways. And then we went out this morning again uh, and kind of the same thing. It was two hooks just shining, just hanging uh, over the water with the bait gone. So we changed some stuff up, put some put the lines up a little higher, just trying it out because we're new to it. We're average outdoorsmen anyways. Um, that's how we hope you guys can relate because not everybody's dreary outdoors or, or what have you. So it's all about, we just enjoy the heck out of it. And sometimes we even enjoy each other. Comment, like, subscribe, as lame as that is. Uh, we really appreciate it. Follow the Instagram. Got a lot of new stuff coming, a lot of new content. We appreciate it. See you guys later.